Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. So today here I am with an another tutorial related to UI and UX designing. So today I'll be talking about why do we need to use 8 dp create. So there are a lot of advantages to it. Firstly, it is considered as a magical number. And just because it gets divisible by 4 and 2 and we don't have any for the decimals left, it's just 8 divided by 4 is 2 and if you divide 8 by 2 is 4 and if you divide 4 with 2 is 2 and if you divide 2 with 2 is 1 so we don't have any more further you know decimals left but what if you take 10 instead of 8 dp what if you take 10 dp grid? you can divide 10 dp with 2 is 5 but when you further go and divide 5 with 2 you would get 2.5 right so which is not a whole number and with this you know the developing becomes very complex so to make it easy and to match with the binary systems we have this 8 dp grid where we can use multiples of 8 like 8 16 then 24 32 40 48 56 and so on so with this it becomes very easy for you to design and also to develop later now i will show you this example in which it is perfectly made in 8 dp grid uh, keeping in mind with the spacing and everything else here it looks a bit messy and distorted because it doesn't follow this 8 magical number 8 rule so here as you can see 48 48 the spacing is 48 by 48 and here is 24 here is 24 the spacing between this two is 24 this this is 24 this is 16 and 16 which is again divisible by 2 it's 24 and 32 but here you can see it's 49 57 30 27 33 and 27 18 which is very uneven and would, won't look proper and would look very unprofessional so to use multiples of 8 is not a myth actually when we use this it has certain facts related to it using this number 8 multiples of 8 in your design would really enhance your design will give it an aesthetic and an appealing look than any others and with this development becomes very easy and as you in you multiply 8 you like 8 16 24 32 now it becomes very easy for the developer to resize few elements by adding 8 or by subtracting 8 so it's just a system that we need to follow and it's very convenient and this is what in google material design it has been highlighted about this 8 point grid there and with this 8 point grid you can create responsive web designs you can create applications mobile applications and everything else now to make your designs you know design faster and more accurately we have a system called design system okay we have design system we need to follow a design system so design system is basically when you have a set of rules for your own designs that the spacing that you will be using is 24 16 and 32 that is and the font sizes you will be using is 14 20 24 with line height and everything else so this is actually some local styles that you need to you know, think of before when you design a website or a mobile application for your thing to look you know perfect and consistent so this design system I'll be talking in my next video so for that please subscribe to my channel and like this video if you really liked it and share it with your friends to know what is this magical number eight you think I should keep making this kind of videos more please subscribe to my channel because it really really motivates me 
to make more videos to do more research and come up with this videos for you all thank you very much